Hello Jeepers! In today's video, I'm showing you how to get your kingpin bearing cups out of your front axle housing. And I'll show you why this is very important that we make sure we have new and good condition bearing cups. The only way to get to your kingpin bearing cup is you have to take apart your knuckles. And make sure you watch my other video on how to disassemble your knuckles. I will be looking at the passenger side king pin bearing cups as the driver's side is the exact same thing. So once you figure out one side, you just copy the other side. And if we look really closely here, we can see that our king pin bearing cup has little ridges on it. And it's actually very, very bad. Because if we take our bearing, so our bearing has little ball bearings on it that will ride in your cup as so. And then when it spins, the little grooves on your cup will get stuck on your bearing balls. And then that will create like a, like a jerking feeling when you're turning. So like the bearing will get stuck and then it'll kind of grab, grab, grab. And then this is actually a very important part when looking at rebuilding your steering because this actually causes lots of problems with your steering. This is why it's so important to get your king pin bearing cups in good condition because you have your knuckle attached to your front axle housing and then you have your tire attached to your knuckle. So your tire will be right here and then all the weight of your tire is actually pushed on to these two bearings. So actually these bearings hold up half the weight of your Jeep. So make sure that these are repaired. To remove both your kingpin bearing cups from your front axle housing, I will use a 15 16 socket and a extender. This is so I can pound out the bearing cup from the inside. So we'll put our socket in the inside, put the extender through the top, and then we'll put it together. And now we'll get a hammer and hit this end and your bearing cup will fall out the bottom. Bearing cup number one, same step for the top bearing cup. Bearing cup number two. And that is how you inspect and get your kingpin bearing cups out of your front axle where your knuckle will be located. We'll make sure that we get these replaced with new cups as there'll be no ridges on your new cup. And this will actually be a big improvement in your steering. So make sure you replace your cups as these cups actually cause lots of grief with your jerky feeling steering. And then we will get our bearings replaced. We'll get these repacked with grease, get the proper grease in our knuckles. So make sure to watch other videos on how to properly rebuild your knuckles. Thanks for watching and make sure to subscribe.